The IOF Physical Technical Institute of the Russian Academy of Sciences for short, IOF Institute, Russian Physikotenyske Institute in RFIOF is one of Russia's largest research centers specialized in physics and technology. The institute was established in 1918 in Petrograd, now St. Petersburg, and run for several decades by Abram Iov. The institute is a member of the Russian Academy of Sciences. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Present structure of the institute. As of 2018, the IOF Institute employs about 1,500 people, around 1,000 of whom are scientific researchers including 560 with a PhD degree and 250 with a doctor and a UK degree. Most of the research staff members are top graduates of the St. Petersburg former Leningrad universities. From 2013 till mid-May 2018 the IOF Institute was under formal jurisdiction of the Federal Agency for Scientific Organizations FASO Russia. now it is under jurisdiction of the established in May 2018 Ministry of Science and Higher Education, like all other institutions of the Russian Academy of Sciences RAS. The institute is organized into five divisions Center for Nano-Heterostructure Physics Solid State Electronics Solid State Physics Plasma Physics, Atomic Physics and Astrophysics Physics of Dielectrics and Semiconductorship of the divisions includes several laboratories. The institute has its own graduate school and a scientific council. There exists an intensive collaboration with the research and industrial establishments in Russia and worldwide. The institute publishes four scientific journals, Semiconductors Russian, Physika i Tenika Poloprovodnikov Physics of the Solid State Russian, Physika Tvedogotela and Technical Physics Journal plus Letters Russian, Zornal Teniskoy Physiki Osnovnoj plus Pisma Topic founding of the Institute The foundation date of the IOF Institute is September 23, 1918 the day of signing the decree on the establishment of the physical and technical department in the established in March of the same year State Röntgenological and Radiological Institute in Petrograd. Despite tremendous economic problems after the World War I and the October Revolution 1917, the development of science was one of the priorities of the new communist government. The above-mentioned department was headed by A. F. I. Off. In 1922, on its basis, the State Physicotechnical Radiology Institute has emerged. After several reorganizations and renaming, since 1933, the institute became Leningrad Physicotechnical Institute. The form Physicotechnical is a Russian variant for physical and technical. Three decades later, in the 1960s, the word IOF was added to the institute name, in honor of the first director. Since 1939, the Institute has been a member of the Academy of Sciences of the USSR since 1991 of the Russian Academy of Sciences. In 1967, it was awarded the Order of Lenin. These details were reflected in the Institute name, especially in Russian. Also now, for historical reasons, there remained the entrance plaque S. Photo, Academy of Sciences of the USSR, AFIOF Physicotechnical Institute, awarded the Order of Lenin Russian, Orodina Lenina Physikotenyske Institute im. 
are fi often sar. Presently, in English texts, for example in scientific papers, the name F. Iof Physical Technical Institute of the Russian Academy of Sciences is used. The optional fragments are enclosed in square brackets. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Main scientific achievements. The Iof Institute is considered the cradle of Soviet physics. Such outstanding scientists as L. D. Landau, P. L. Kapitza started their career here, many physicists among them Y. B. Zeldovich, I. V. Kurchatov, I. E. Tam have worked at the Institute for some time. The research of the Institute covers nearly all fields of the contemporary physics, including the solid state, semiconductors, quantum electronics, astrophysics, plasma, fluid dynamics, cosmology, nuclear synthesis. More than 100 employees of the Institute were recognized by awarding the highest prizes and orders of the Soviet Union and of Russia, in particular the Lenin and State Prizes of the USSR, State Prizes of Russia, Government Prizes and Special Prizes of the Soviet, Russian Academy of Sciences. Twice, the Nobel Prize was awarded for the works performed at the IOF Institute. In 1956, academician N. N. Semenov together with C. N. Hinshelwood got the Nobel Prize in Chemistry for a discovery and study of chain reactions. The works were made and published in 1927, when N. N. Semenov was a staff member of the Institute. In 2000, Z. H. I. Alfarov, director of the IOF Institute at that time, became a Nobel Prize laureate in physics together with H. Cromer and J. Kilby for the development of semiconductor heterostructures for high-speed optoelectronics. The IOF Institute has played a central role in the development of photovoltaic solar power in Russia and internationally, and thus in the development of renewable energy. Buildings <inaudible> 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 The main building of the IOF Institute S, photo at the top of the article and the very left part of the photo below is located at Polytechnicheskaya Street, 26. It was built in a neoclassicism style in 1912-1916 by the architect G. D. Grimm and served as a refuge for the elderly needy hereditary noblemen in commemoration of the 300th anniversary of the Romanovs' house. At the 40 prized ones, on the second floor they arranged church now the small assembly hall of the institute. In 1920 the building was adapted to the institute by the design of civil engineers P. I. Sidorov and U. V. Bylinsky. The ceremonial transfer of the building to the Institute took place on February 4, 1923. Until 1953, the apartment of AFI OFF was located in the same building. In the years 1927, 1928 there appeared a yard part, and in 1970 the building was reconstructed and expanded along Kurchatov Street. Beyond this historical building, a more modern building on another side of the Kurchatov Street the right part of the photo also belongs to the IOF Institute. It was constructed in the 1970s. Furthermore, some laboratories of the IOF Institute are placed in Shuvalovo, a northwest outskirts of St. Petersburg. 
In front of the main façade are the busts of Abram Ioff sculptor G. D. Glickman, 1964, and Boris Konstantinov, sculptor Mikhail Anikushin, 1975. On either side of the main entrance are memorial plaques, to the left of the entrance are S. N. Zhirkov, Yuli Borisovich Karatin, Anatoly Alexandrov, Yakov Frenkel, and V. M. Tuchkovich, right of the entrance, Igor Kurchatov, B. P. Konstantinov, Nikolai Semenov. Directors of the Institute Before 1950 Abram Ioff 1950–1957 A. P. Komar 1957–1967 Boris Konstantinov 1967–1987 V. M. Tuchkovich 1987–2003 Georges Alfarov 2003–2018 A. G. Zabrodsky January to September, 2018 Sergei V. Lebedev acting. Since October, 2018 Sergei V. Ivanov acting equals equals some notable people associated with the institute